Thank the sun. You look like a fighter, and that's just what we need. My bung brain boss gave us the wrong crate of ammo. It was marked ammunition, but stuffed with Ridgewood. Without that ammo, we're struggling to fend off watchers. And worse. I'll do what I can to help. Glad to hear it. We need all the... Alarms! Long leg approaching! Two arms! Two arms! Oh shit, let's go. Alright, his weakness is precision arrows. Boom, dead. That easy to deal with. You good, bro? Where are they? Jesus Christ. Get back. Scum. Well, that was straight into it. What was that called? Long leg. I'd have to ditch something. I don't think I've come across that one before. Not even a challenge. Well, for me it wasn't, but for you guys, you were getting absolutely demolished. If it wasn't for me, you guys would be dead. Scrap a lens. How does the weather change that quickly? It was just sunny just now, and now all of a sudden it's dark as hell. And it seems like it's probably going to rain as well. It's like dark and cloudy now. Alright, let's talk to this guy. I've seen machine hunters before, but none like you, Outlander. You saved our asses. Boss! The song cores are gone! What? That's impossible. Unless... Unless Dereed took them. When the first wave hit us, one of the men ran off. Dereed. I thought he was a coward. Turns out he's a thief, too. He couldn't have gotten far. True, but we're in no shape to go after him. Then I'll get him for you. But this time, I get paid. Can't argue with that. Bring those Sonkors back and you'll get a share. As I should. I find a reed. So this is where the pussy ran away to then. This is where he ran off. Alright. Let's follow the tracks. See where this pussy went. Oh, what a coward, but then again, like that guy's boss was stupid to give them ammunition. Well, give them Ridgewood, but it put them in a box and say it was ammunition. Like, I'm not sure if he was stupid or he did it on purpose. Oh, here he is. What are you doing, you pussy? Hello, Dorid. Who are you? The caravan sent me. The caravan? What caravan? The one you sabotaged. You figured no explosive arrows meant no survivors, no witnesses to your crime. Look, stranger, I have debts. If I don't pay, the dicers will gouge out my eyes. What the fuck is this? I was invisible as well. It's dropping mines. How's that taste? Got him. Well, those mines or are they sensors? What is this? A stalker. Well, I guess that's a suitable name for it since it can turn invisible. Or it can go invisible. And this guy got wrecked. Oh, he's still alive. The caravan. Did they live? Yes. I got to them in time. Thank you. 
as I turn and embrace the sun, may he burn away my sins. What a waste. At least he died better than he lived. Wow, okay. A bit brutal to say, Aloy, but you're not wrong. Alright, now let's get back to them. Get my share. So that's two new machines I've encountered. One in that caravan fight and one with Derid. Getting sniped by a stalker. Was it a stalker? I think it was a stalker, right? Well, actually, let me check my notebook. Yeah, a stalker. So what is it? It has machine... Dart gun, mine launcher, stealth generator. And then long leg. Concussion sack, alarm signal antenna. Interesting. Alright, uh, these lot still alive. You're back. And with the sound cores, I see. And Dorid? A uh, stalker got him. It wasn't pretty. And you beat a stalker. That's worth a bonus. Here, take my share. You've earned it. I'll see to the caravan from here. I think the rest of the trip will go smoother. Well, I should hope for your sake it does. Now let's get on with this one. Find the entrance. Remarkable reward box. Okay. Oh, let's see. Got some scrappers, but ain't nothing I dealt with before. Well, I haven't dealt with. That was in the eye. Come on. There you go. Space. There's a very interesting looking entrance. Pyramid shaped. A triangle door. Why a door? But how to open it? Oh, use override it, yeah, use your spear. inside what is in this place what will I find repel down how big is this place that's uh, some what is this Supply crate. Interesting looking supply crate. Look at all these wires. Metal, the light. It's like this entire place is part of some huge machine. But who made it? Well, either people did, or machines did, or both. It's literally like a triangle cable section, like... That thing looks like a triangular pipe. What's it for? Like this. Oh. There's a watcher. Duct of unknown design, vulnerable to impact, contains non-toxic gas and may obstruct visual detection. Um... Okay. Is that watcher supposed to be there? Or is it glitched inside the wall? Oh, 
What is this? Magnetic container rail? Can support human weight. So these things like create a smoke so I can hide in it. Not the best. Dumbass watches. Stupid watches. So, do I gotta climb on one of those things? Or I can go this way, I guess. I don't think I need to, actually, I can go this way. Everything's the same, it's all triangular. It's going to be interesting to see what I find in this place. There's nothing up there, is there? No, nothing. It's even like little pyramids, so what's that about? Right, climb up here then. What is this place? I can't see, it's so dark. What is this? Network uplink. Console. Console of unknown design may be vulnerable to military grade override. A thing near the gap. What does it do? Can I override it? Oh, oh nice. Made myself a cable bridge. Another supply crate. It's it's just so funny how everything's triangular. There's so many like it's like a triangular hallway, you got little pyramids, you got triangular lights, triangular doors. Everything's just triangle. Those flying machines move components around. Might be able to take me somewhere. Oh, so I gotta jump on one of those, do I? Okay, wait for the next one. There it comes. Might regret this. No, well, we'll see. That's true. The machines are built in this place. Why? Who knows? Don't know. How big is this place? When do I get off? Oh, I see a machine that there's machines in here. Okay then. Right, so you got watchers, of course. This place is huge. How do I get up there? No. Wait, right, hang on. Oh, I can just go that way. Ouch. 
Ah, uh, okay, maybe I do need to grab onto that to get across. Oh, and climb up. Yeah, I think I need to jump on this to get across. Oh, there we go. Get a supply crate. Do those watches even move? Because it just seems like they're just scan in the same spot. Well, let me just sneak up and kill it. Well, that's one down. How can it see me? What's the point of the smoke? I thought the whole point of the smoke was so it couldn't see me and yet it's still dead. Well, it's not like I'm exactly hidden, but I thought that was the whole point of that, so I can be hidden. Because there's not like there's any bushes for me to hide in in here. Okay, can I go this way? I'll do it again, grab on one of these things to get across. Well, I mean, how long have these, like, factories? How long have these factories been on for? And how many machines have they been building? What is that? It's a shell walker. Now it's weak to precision arrows. Oh. Oh. Oh, got it. Got him. No, you're not, you're not, you're not blinding me, bitch. Alright, there's another one. Well, that was a new machine, a shell walker. Seriously? Can I craft more room? Oh, I can. Okay, let me look at ammo. Uh, no, I won't do that. Can I pick it up now? No. Stop sliding. Pick it up. Well, let me go on that one. Is there anything better? I guess not. And that is a resource. I can't really open any of that resources. Um, what could I drop? I guess I'll drop this because i got loads of that. Loads of it. It's a lot of Ridgewood, but... Look at this. Don't really need it because i got loads of it. More than enough. I don't need any more. There's so much of this place to explore. Another supply crate. Like even I, even with like the max upgrades to like 
the amount of stuff I can carry, I'm still carrying so much stuff I can't pick up any more stuff. What is this? What kind of shit is going on in this place? Alright. Ah, oh, there I go. I can make myself a bridge. There's, yep, supply kite. Another supply kite. Medicine. Oh, what's in there? I know it's Ridgewood, right? Yeah, I can't pick up any more of that. Don't really need to. I've got plenty of it. Can I shoot it? Yeah, that works. And there's a plant down there. I want to pick that up. Um, let me drink one of these. There you go. Can I go this way? No, that's just a dr way. Well, actually, no, I can't go that way, can't I? No, I can't. No, I don't think that no, I can. I need to go back up top. No, I can't pick it up. I've maxed out on resources and I've fully upgraded my resource capacity and I still can't pick up more stuff. I've just got that much stuff. I right, go on, cross. How do I go this way? Another supply crate. There's quite a few of these. Oh, looks like I'm ziplining. Let's see where this goes. It's not like I can go anywhere else anyway. Okay, anything useful over here? No. Okay, another bridge. I have to override. What am I going to be doing in this place? To the heart. Am I destroying this place? I mean, it seems like that would be the best thing to do. Destroy, destroy this place so it stops making more machines. Another one. Good thing I like check behind me. So much of his stuff. What were these machines used for anyway? Because I've like read some like stuff like from collectibles like about Bots and That's droids and stuff, but that doesn't seem the same or sound the same as these machines. Like, were these machines made for the purpose of, like, rebuilding civilization and that sort of stuff? So, they, like, make the earth, like, a better place for the... What is that? Fire bellow... Fire, yeah, bellow bag. So I'm guessing these machines were made to make the world like a more habitable and livable place. But then they've just obviously gone a bit hostile. I gotta fight this thing? If I gotta fight this thing, I'll fight it. Should have brought a cart. Uh, yeah, I literally need one.
I wanted to try and override it because I'm guessing I'm going to have to be fighting this thing. Oh, this definitely seems like a boss battle. But uh, what do I do? Override the core. How do I do that? I guess I gotta climb these towers. And then, like, mess them up. Right, let me get the supply crate first. Oh, there's another one. Okay, I can't help. So override. Oh, he's mad. Oh, it's dead now. That wasn't so bad. Well, of course, that's because I prepared myself. I checked what its weaknesses were, got the weapon required to take it down, and just took it down. Easy as easy as that. Just two shots of precision arrows and it's dead. So do I need to override? Sigma overrides available, so there's five more. Oh, uh, look at that. Grazer, Sawtooth, Lancehorn, and Scrapper. So now I can override those machines. If you notebook. Okay. So now I can override some more machines then. So is this place going to stop building machines now? Alright, well that's that one done. And what's this one? Revenge of the Nora. Go to Red Echoes. Yeah, I guess I'll do that one. Let me look at the quest. Yeah, so that's one of the main quests, that one. Yeah, those two are quite far away. Okay, and then where's that one? Okay, that's that one. Well, I haven't been able to do that one. Not because I couldn't try to do it, but I had to be like level 25 to do it. But I'm guessing now I can do it, because before it was level 25 and it was like highlighted in red. Obviously saying that you're not a high enough level to do it or a close enough level 225 to probably do it, but now I'm guessing I can do it. So I guess I'll do that after I do this main mission. Yeah, all right, well, let's go then. Let's get out. Uh, no. Okay, yeah, let's just run there. Well, I've definitely got to try and override these machines now that I couldn't override before. But I feel that's only useful if um, I need help in fighting other machines. If it's just on its own, then I'll just kill it. Good 
this'll last. That should do. I need it to craft stuff. There's a dead watcher. How far? Oh, Bella backside. Well, I don't see any. Unless that's it up there. No, that's a strider. I'm going to try and override that strider. Okay, just sneak up on this one. Quite a few of them. Overriding its ass. Go, go. Alright, there you go. That's that one dealt with. Corrupted zone discovered. Oh, there it is. Oh, and it's corrupted. I um Oh Am I not shooting that? There you go. I should have probably taken that fire resistant thing beforehand, but I felt like I could deal with it without getting burnt, but I did, so whatever. And my strider got killed, which is great. I swear I shot this thing in the sack and it didn't blow up. And they always kept taking too long to pull the bow back to let off another arrow. I found a vantage point. I wonder what it used to be. Well, it's not really much of a vantage point, but let's see what it is. Apaka shit storm tour, day five. The gray swarms open for turtle smash the night I OD'd here. Or so the police report said, anyway. I was 15 years old. When I woke in the hospital, two days later, your face was the first thing I saw. What is this, a concert? You're 15 years old and you're overdosing. What is wrong with you? There we go, another corrupt zone cleared. And I felt like I did think about maybe trying to sneak up on it and see if I can override it, but I think I don't think that would work because it's corrupted, but then I could try and override the corruption, but I'll try it next time, but I don't think it will let me. We'll see. Right, what's this? So what is it? Okay, I want to get something off my chest right now because this needs to be said. To all Jessifans and to the entire Romantic Fortunes fan community, Jessica Sterling should not win Romantic Fortunes. This is so obvious to anyone who actually pays attention. I used to be like you guys. Last season I watched Jessica to win. I wanted Jessica to win. But as of episode 3 1, she has gone too far. Were you people even watching when she rejected Luis? The sweetest human being on the planet. He stood by her through everything. The Alaska acquisition, that time the Harrier bots malfunctioned mid-battle. The only reason Jessica has had any success is because Louise had her back. He loves her, or she doesn't even care. This is why I'm throwing my support behind Vern wait, Vernon. I do not take this decision lightly. I was a Jessica fan for two whole seasons. 
Jessica is the whole reason I even care about Sterling Mulkeet, but as a fan, I cannot continue to support someone so heartless, or wish you can do better. What is this, some shitty reality show? That's what it sounds like. A charger. What is this, like a big ass goat? Big ass machine goat? So I need to go to Red Echoes. There's more machines. I'd have to leave something else behind. Okay, that's fine. Well, that's a big tower. Campfire discovered. Oh, there's people here. Devil's grief. Foreboding sight, huh? Don't you ever wonder what it used to look like? Back when the old ones lived here. You're not like other Nora. That's what they tell me. War Chief? Our scouts found enemy camps in the ruins, guarding the approach to the Ring of Metal. Then we should hit those camps first. Make sure they stay quiet. Agreed. Wipe out the camps, and our enemies in the Ring of Metal won't see us coming. I'll take out the alarms. We'll send braves to each camp to lie in wait. What you start, they'll help finish. Alright, sounds like a plan. I'm going to try and stealth it, though. And this looks like a tank. Yeah, that's definitely looking like a tank. What is she doing? She's giving up her speech. It's like, bitch, you're supposed to be getting the Braves ready to attack. Bring that up later. Okay, they got corrupt machines, of course they do. And they're leaving like a trail of corruption as well. Yeah, so I can't uncorrupt it. If I could uncorrupt it, it would have given me the option then, but it only gave me the option to kill it. Okay. Right, so there are people. Is that the alarm? Okay, so that's the alarm. It looks like there's only four of them. Oh, f yeah, four of them. All right, he's down. It's just three left. I right, kill this watcher as well, and then I can try and get closer to him. Hey, look at this trail of corruption. Oh, shit. That hurts me? What the hell? Right, let's get in there and kill these scum. What's he doing? We 
Alright, right, shut up, you lot. Jesus Christ. Just because they're down doesn't mean you can start screaming. I'd have to ditch something. I'm still going to take out that alarm as well. No, don't get on it. Destroy it. Alright, I'll we'll stop the alarms going off. And this is blaze container. Reinforced wooden barrel contains blaze, highly flammable. Right, what's this? Let's go. Get out of the way. Why are you bunching up? Don't bunch up. Okay, another supply crate. And what's that? Ancient debris. Supply crate. And then what's that? That's a blaze container. And what's this? Supply crate. Watch out, yeah. Okay. I get this one as well. I can't spare the weight. That's fine. We're gonna go check that ancient debris as well and get the stuff from that. That wasn't too bad. It was like four guys and two watchers. So I'm guessing these basic killers aren't the ones who do the corrupting. Uh, oh, there's probably someone else who's like got that power to do that. Time to take out the other two camps as well. So where's their main camp then? Oh, it must be here then. I'm guessing that's their main camp. Can I get in between there? Yeah. Okay, and let me look around as well. Oh, careful now. I've been seen. Okay, there's a few of them about. He saw me, but he was the only one who saw me, so that's fine. I got there's still quite a few buildings here and some of them are quite tall as well, like skyscraper. Right, it's another one down. That's what I need to be wary of, is not the killers as but the machines as well, the corrupt Should've ones. So I guess that's a another thing that's different about other machines, even like aggressive ones without being corrupted, is that they got a little trail of corruption which can hurt you if you go into it. I want to try and find... what's that? Watcher? What's this? Ancient debris. Yeah, there it is. There you go, found it. Right, hang on. What do I have plenty of that I could drop to pick up more stuff? Yeah, I'll drop this ridge wood. Even though that's a lot of ridge wood, I've got loads of it anyway. Okay. Alright, well, let me drop more ridge wood then. Even though it's a shitload of ridge wood, I've still got shitloads more even without it. Okay, let's go to this camp. Can't pick it up. And this is obviously used to be a gas station. Not anymore though. What's that? All the same. 
Okay, personal log user 67,681. I'm so sick of these robot battle hollows. How many of these things can you watch before you realize that every single episode is exactly the same? You show up on the battlefield, you watch a bunch of fresher bots tear each other up, you choose which corp you're going to root for, explosions, 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 and then it's over. Am I the idiot? Everyone else seems to love this stuff. Well, that's the thing. You can easily simplify something down to like like a few things and say, that's all it is. Sure, you're not wrong, but you're not right either. Like, there's more to it than just that. There's more to it. Ancient bracelet. Looks like I'm going to have to drop more ridge wood. And I have tried setting Ridgewood to traders, but they don't want that stuff. Because I guess it's so common. And what is this? China Sick? I have to be honest, I miss Guangdong already. I had proposed I had a purpose there. I was busy all the time, nobody here seems to get it. Sandy and Vanessa took me out last week. Welcome home, I guess. Some guy at the bar freaks out when he ever hears how I just got back. Acts like I was living underground with mole people or something. Like I should be ashamed. I actually wanted to have a job and work for a living. Ugh. Guess it's reverse culture shock. Or maybe I should just go back. Well, that's how it is in some places. Apparently to that dumbass who ever heard your conversation at the bar was like, You did a job? You worked for a living and wanted to do it? Oh my god. It's like, why would you do that? It's like, well, culture shock. What's wrong with you people? Lazy ass Americans. Of course, it's not like they give you the choice to work or not in China, do they? It's either you do or you don't. And if you don't, it's probably because you're in the, you're dead. Oh, that was close. You know, you saw me then. Okay, so there's one. Oh, there's a few more here this time. That's a lot more than the previous one. No brave. Okay. There's a lot more this time. There's like what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's quite a few of them. That's right, come in, you dumbass. Your mum, come and look. <laughs> Swift swack over the head. Alright, let me shoot this guy. Alright, all good so far. No one heard nothing. Get wrecked. Right, I think there's only like three of them left now. Right, careful, I don't hit that. Alright, there you go. There you go, got him. Again, done. Forget about traveling light. Perfectly stealth. I'm gonna have to drop more ridgewood. There's so much stuff to pick up, I can't. Jesus. I want to be able to pick this up, because that is a slag shine glass. More Ridgewood will have to be dropped. Search cult as fuck, yeah. Take a shit.
I'll take that as well. Alright, one more camp left. And then it's like onto the main one. Fresh as it comes. Well, how fresh can you get? Got ya. Animal Tooth Talisman, come on. Oh. Are you serious? Really? Jesus Christ. I meant to shoot the fox and I shot that guy in the foot. What? How many are here? So I just killed one. Okay. How many was that? There's four of them. At least from what I can see, there's four of them. Oh no. Oh no, there's a lot more than four. It's like, what, seven of them? I wonder if I can whistle someone over. Okay. Let me use my precision arrows. There you go, that's one. And that's another one. No one suspects anything. was close, he nearly set the alarm off then. Got him. I don't think he set the alarm off, did he? What the hell's going on over there? Aiming and an easy way to be for the rest of the day. Okay, I think we're good. I'd have to leave something else behind. Oh, I think we're in the clear. It seems like they're excavating. What are they digging up? So go to the tallest tower. All right, nice work, boys. Time to go to the tallest tower. Because that's like the outer camps dealt with. Now it's like time to go for their main camp. Look how tall. That is a tall ass building. Is it supposed to be like... You know, like swerved like that or is it just like twisted around like that because it's like collapsing i think it's supposed to look swerved what's going on the camps have been dealt with 
Now to the Ring of Metal. Its high walls protect the enemy. We'll have to scale the height. Under fire if we're detected. I have another idea. Their base has a weakness. Send me in alone, and I'll exploit it. If I'm successful, I'll blow a hole in those walls big enough for the entire war party to charge through. Sounds like a plan. So long as I get to come with you. A war chief should be grateful for two arrows so eager to spring from the bow. Yes, Varl. Go with Aloy as her spearmate, but be vigilant. Yes, war chief. I will. Go now. We wait on your signal. Okay. Let me get all this stuff first. Full already. What's that? Vantage. Uh, I've probably got to climb the building, don't I? Yeah, look, I can climb up. How high up, though? Okay, which way do I go now? Do I climb up? Okay. How high up am I climbing? Right, jump across. Careful now. Oh, this is it. I wonder what it'll show. Well, let's see. Oh, wow. The shitstorm tour, day six. I was fresh out of rehab when we saw the metallurgists play the Hearts Wayfarers. The M in Jersey looked pretty funny. Hopefully, you're sorry. So this is a stadium. I look at it now. Is that like a baseball stadium? Does she not get rope burn when she does that? Because it sounds like she's going down quick, like to the point where she should be getting rope burn from that. You think she would have some gloves on? You do have a plan, right? Yes. I just need to go save first. That's the first part of the plan. All right. Do I need to craft anything before I go in? I can do a skill now. Strike from below. Okay, um, strong strike. Hold circle for a long dodge roll or tap circle for a short dodge roll. Dodge prowess. Increase the maximum duration of concentration. Use R1 while, to not, while aiming to notch an additional arrow. At least some of these upgrades sound pretty good. I think I'll go with increasing maximum duration of concentration. 